Hello everyone, this is Eddie the Magic Monk. Welcome to my series of lessons on Matrix Transformations. And this series of videos is designed for people who already know a little bit about matrices. So hopefully you have done my other matrices lessons and you know how to multiply matrices and you know how to find the inverse of matrices and how to solve matrix equations and things like that already and this is designed to show you guys um, some uh, geometric applications to what matrices can do in terms of transforming shapes or points or curves on a Cartesian plane okay so let's start with the most simplest transformation which is just a translation so I'm gonna show you by using an example let's say I have a simple matrix with one column okay let's say I have two and three in one matrix and I add it to another matrix let's say four and six and I end up with 2 plus 4 which is 6 and 3 plus 6 which is 9. So what does this matrix addition actually mean? Well I'm gonna show you guys using GeoGebra. So in GeoGebra I'm going to draw my first matrix as a point so the point is 2 3 so let me just type that in so bracket 2 comma 3 and as you can see the point is over here x is 2 y is 3 and what I'm going to do is I'm going to now add point A to another point which is 4 and 6 so I'm going to go point A plus bracket 4 comma 6 and I'm gonna see what happens and it's given me another point at 6 and 9, which is the answer. Okay, so let's have a look at what's happened here. It has moved, um, it has moved 4 units to the right. Okay, this point has moved 4 units to the right from x to 2 to x to 6. And it has moved 6 units upwards from 3 to 9. Okay, so that is basically the concept of a translation. So a translation is defined as moving a point or a set of points in one direction. Which is what we have done here. We have moved this point from here. We've moved it in one direction, which is this direction. And we have moved it up here. Now the question is, how do we define this direction? Well, the direction is defined as a certain number of units, let's call it A, A units parallel to the X axis and B units parallel to the y axis okay and let's now come up with a general formula for translation okay and I'm going to name the first matrix 2 and 3 I'm going to name it as X and Y and I'm going to call this the original point plus A and B which I'm going to call the translation matrix X plus X Y plus A B equals X dash Y dash which is the image the image of our original point. The image of our original point, which is x dash y dash. 
okay where the result is where it has been moved to so let's apply this concept we have learned to a question okay so let's have a quick go at this problem here translate the triangle ABC as shown in this diagram using the tra uh, translation matrix 4 negative 2 and draw the image okay so let's <clears throat> do it one point at a time so we're moving four units horizontally and negative two units vertically so let's start with point C let's go four units to the right one two three four two units down one two so we have C dash and we're gonna do the same with point A one two three four one two A dash and B one two three four one